What's up everybody, Days here, back with another Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 video, and today we are talking about how to unlock Super Saiyan God. Now, as of the time of this video coming out, the free update is not out yet, but we do have some new information about how we're going to be able to unlock Super Saiyan God, and also a little bit of information on how Super Saiyan God will work for our created characters. Make sure you stay around to the end because I will be giving you tips and uh, suggested videos to some of my other videos that can help you to get this stuff done before the DLC and the free update actually drops. That way you are prepared and as soon as it comes out, you're going to be able to go and unlock Super Saiyan God. So like I said, make sure you do stick around t until the end. So the first thing we're talking about is this right here. In order to unlock Super Saiyan God, you will need maximum friendship with Goku, Gohan, Videl, Gotenks, Pan, and Vegeta. Now, if you've been playing the game for a while, you probably already have max friendship on all these characters. Um, but one thing I will suggest, because they do not say right here whether or not this needs to be done on a Saiyan character. Now, me personally, I started off with a male Earthling, so on my main account, my male Earthling has max friendship on pretty much all of those, but not a Saiyan character. So I do suggest, just to be on the safe side... Level up your, your male Saiyan or female Saiyan, whichever one you want to use. Get them up to 99 because it will probably have to be a level 99. And maximize your friendships with these characters right here just to make sure because you don't want to have to do that after it drops. I know Super Saiyan Blue and Super Saiyan Blue Evolved. You could do it with any race, but that does not mean that's how it will work with this one. So guys, make sure you do that on a Saiyan character just in case you still have a couple days until this is going to come out. Now, if you need help maximizing your friendships, I will leave a suggested video right here for that. That way you guys can get that done uh, fast, easy, and we always want to be doing multiple things at once. That's one of the things that, that I try and really instill in people is that you need to be doing multiple things at once because this game is a real grind with everything you have to do. So check out that video if you do need help with that. Also, if you need help leveling up and you need some tips for that, I will leave another suggested video somewhere in here for how to level up fast. Alright, so now on to the next thing. And this is something that everybody has been speculating and, and we all figured it was going to happen because when Super Saiyan God Vegeta came out, and I showed this in a previous video of how will Super Saiyan God work, when you do your inputs at a certain in a certain way, you get the timing right, you get more power on your attacks. And what this says right here, they were they were good enough to translate this. Shout out to uh, the Reach Out for the original post and uh, Josh Husky here because they did all the translations for this as far as I know. Effect overwhelming basic attack power compared to other Super Saiyan Awakening techniques boasts a rate of increase. By inputting at a specific timing of combo attack power has increased. In addition, the recovery speed of skill has also increased. So basically, everybody was right, and this will work like Super Saiyan God Vegeta. With good timing on your inputs, you will be able to get off that increased damage. Now for that last sentence, though. In addition, the recovery speed of skill is also increased. I'm not 100% sure what this means. It could mean several things. could mean your key regeneration is increased. Uh, it could mean your stamina regeneration is increased. It could be both of them. Um, so that is something we will have to wait to see what that increase is because the translations aren't always the best. Now, guys, one thing I do highly suggest, if you haven't already and you are newer to the game, I have a Mail Saiyan combo guide. You're going to see a little clip here of me just doing all the different types of cancels and stuff. It is a longer video, but I do suggest you check it out because it's going to get you very familiar with your combos. It's going to get you very familiar with all the different kind of cancel combos and stamina break combos. And it's something that you really need to know about your character. Also, if you are looking for a good build, I will leave another suggested video in here for my Mail Saiyan Balance build and my Mail Saiyan Strike build. Because those are two very good ones for the male Saiyan, especially that balance build. I suggest you really check that video out, man, because I do great damage all across the board with that character. In fact, it's the one I'm using right here. This is my male Saiyan balance build. So check those videos out, guys. Get familiar with the combos. Max out the friendship on a Saiyan character. I know it didn't work that way with the other ones, but you never know how they may change that. So maximize your friendship with a level 99 male Saiyan. And yeah... That's going to wrap this video up. If you do like the content I'm putting out, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.